G'day mates, Train Simulator Driver here. I'm just going to run you through a really quick lightning tutorial on getting going with the Gronk and the Rail Driver. So, let's get inside, shall we? Let's jump in our seat. First thing we need to do is turn it on. So we're going to use the master switch key to move it to on, and to engine only, and again to engine start. Engine's running, so we can let it go. Then we use the other master switch key, the one on the bottom row, to take it back into on. Okay, we've got a little bit of space behind us. Our handbrake is released, so let's look at the other controls. We've got our train brake going up to full service. You can go up to emergency, but I won't. And we've got our straight brake or our locomotive brake or our independent brake, whatever you want to call it. Everybody calls it something different. Let's turn on our cab lights and our gauge lights, headlights or marker lights. And if you really want them, you can have the wipers on. Let's just turn that off again. All right, now, next control is our reverser. So we've got forwards and reverse. So we'll just use reverse first. So let's release the train brake and give it a little bit of throttle. And we're cruising off backwards now. Turn that off again. Back on with the train brake. Now that we've stopped, back into forwards. Release the train brake. And forwards we go. Hit a horn. And the other buttons do the kinds of things you would expect. Alright, let's throttle off. Train brake back on, and that's it for this tutorial. I always do really quick, simple tutorials. If you like them, please give the video a like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you very much for watching this lightning tutorial on the Class 08, the Gronk with Rail Driver. Bye now.